IGY6 Games, the gamer channel that brings you a variety of entertainment and content. Bo here and here. And before we kick things off, we appreciate the love by y'all sharing and hitting the, those icons that need to click. And with that said, check out our social meds, what we post daily, and keep in touch with our followers. Now let go. Thanksgiving Day. Thanksgiving Day, Ubisoft. Paris. <laughs> Thanksgiving Day, we get the new raid. Or the first raid, Project Titan. Now I want to cover a few things that led to why I feel the way I do about the release of this raid. Let's start first with the initial confusion when the raid would be released. Uh, so I get straight to the game and thinking, you know, the raid would be a week out or something. So got straight into the game grind to get to level 150 to be eligible to run the raid and of course that went through playing the elite faction missions faction missions clearing out all the bases that were higher level and daily farm behemoths and amens and whatever other bases I haven't got and a little PvP but you didn't level up too quick and so, while doing that, completely avoid the campaign, which I would imagine the developers would not want happen with your gamers. They would kind of, I guess they don't care. Well, yeah, they want you playing in game and staying in. So, yeah, I've literally played like three missions of the campaign and leveled up to like mid 230s right now. And got burnt out just doing elite faction missions and all the things I said before. Now cut to two weeks later. Still no news. And gone way beyond 150. Doing the same old same. And still no news of the raid. And yet we, we do. We get the year one map. And the year one map says early December. But I'll get to that later. My bad. But the year one map says early December. Keep that in mind. Now don't get me wrong. I enjoyed the gameplay. I enjoyed the PvP. Maxing out all the classes. The elite faction missions. The faction missions. The side missions. Clearing bases. Exploring the island. All of that was cool. But then. I got burnt out. So what do we do? We go to a new game. And wait for the new content to release which was the raid and again year one map said early December so I figured hey I got some time to get the clan ro uh, the raid roster ready and we figured we had a week and at the most two to get them to level 150 and be ready and then we get the news yesterday that it drops Thanksgiving Day and for other parts of the world, that would be November 28th <laughs> in your country. Oh, so us Americans. Oh, my God. You know, I'm sorry. Europeans, uh, South America, the Asian countries, Australia, Africa. Get this. They do it with one hour before the Dallas Cowboy game. If that's not the biggest Thanksgiving tradition to watch the Cowboy game, eating your turkey, and drinking a little whatever you want. Kids, drink your tea or water, Coke, whatever. I, am, myself, am going to participate in the raid at release. Now, who gives a shit? Y'all don't care about that. The point is, the year one map plan said early December. So that screws the raid roster that we're getting together. And then going back to the beginning, we had to wait a couple weeks before when we knew the raid was coming. So I don't know if they like dropping content ahead of time to surprise us. And we'll take it as, oh golly boy gee. I guess some will, but... Unfortunately for my situation and a lot of Americans, 
this was bad timing and the surprise was no bueno oh my god the Cowboys game Jesus <laughs> and again don't get me wrong although it is the day before Thanksgiving I am going to take the time to put the raid gear together get those attributes I think will help out get the perks selected that'll be fun and the anticipation draws as it get closer I would like to beat the raid day one if it's doable I am console and console gamers y'all know we don't have the advantage of PC sorry PCers truth the biggest point to this video and this rant if yeah sure let's call it that is that I regret the way I approach this game normally I would go through the campaign first and put off all the side missions and all the uh, extraneous activity that would be saved for you know after campaigns beat you want to know the story first right so with three missions in I'm just gonna start the campaign all over of course after the raid now now to the good news or future talk I'm excited for the four new classes you got the engineer the hunter the banshee and the echelon I'm probably probably going to lean towards Banshee or Hunter first. They seem like they're going to be the running gunners up in your face kind of game. Then there's the live event, maybe in 2 weeks. I'm not definitely not going to try to schedule it. <laughs> no faith in the scheduling of this. So you got the Terminator live event. We have new PVP maps, the new class. It's all cool. And I imagine another episode with the faction missions. Now let's get into the approaching the raid. What y'all's game plan? What class selection are you going to use? I imagine people might do the medic to get the revive. But I'm probably going to stick with the salt. A little extra armor. We'll see. What are you going to spec into with your gear? I honestly can't say. Unless, like I mentioned before, I haven't been playing much lately. As of recent. But damn sure I'm going to be playing today. But I'm kind of curious to see what y'all think. With what y'all are going to go with the build. Without knowing anything about the raid. Other than it's on Gollum Island. And it's a volcano. And I would imagine we're fighting wolves. Maybe a mix. Sentinels and wolves. My curiosity builds by the minute. <laughs> I really want to get this raid done tomorrow. God, that'd be nice. And if you're curious about the raid, either you haven't leveled up or you just won't have time to run it all through the weekend, because we understand that as Americans, it's a busy, oh man, these next several days, crazy here in America. Oh, those shoppers. Oh, anyway, I will be posting the first raid run, Victor or not. I'm not ashamed to fail as long as you get back up and get on that horse. But be looking for the uh, first attempt at the raid tomorrow. And hopefully I get damn good at it and get out some tips to y'all. Hopefully. What if I suck? Ah, I don't think like that, Bo. Well, I guess all there's left to say is happy Thanksgiving, everybody. And hell, while I'm at it, Let's go with the uh, happy Kwanzaa, happy Hanukkah. Sorry, I can't, I can't do the. <laughs> oh, oh man, that hurt. All right, happy and oh, I was gonna say, it. you know what? Merry Christmas, and apologies to any of the religious holidays that I missed in this time of year. So good luck with the raid, everybody. All you ghosts, May. The best four get the job done first. I hope it's not y'all. And enjoy it. I mean, hell, it is a game. Or is it? And as we close out, hope you got what you came for. Share with your mates. Click those buttons that need the clicking. Want to catch us in action? Check out the squad as we stream. Schedule down below in the description. Swing on by and say hello. And as always, I say...
Peace.